Downtown development in Miami is skyrocketing. Nearly 6,000 new apartments and 2,500 condos are under construction. Plus, a 70-story mixed-use building called Ocon Tower will sit on North Miami Avenue near Northwest 6th Street, and it's set to break ground this summer. And there are other additions planned for the Magic City skyline. CBS 4's Ashley Dyer is live in downtown Miami tonight with more. And Ashley, Miami Mayor Francis Suarez has a lot to say about this. Yes, he does, Lauren, and it's also clear that everyone wants a little piece of our paradise. Within the next couple of years, this skyline will include 14 additional skyscrapers. Mayor Suarez says the city is more desirable right now than it's ever been before. From Wynwood to Brickell and downtown to Miami Beach, cranes and construction are everywhere. Everybody wants to be here. We're an extremely desirable city, which is a good thing. We're not going to be less desirable, but it's also creating a bit of a supply glut, which is raising prices a little bit because a lot of people want to come. Since the pandemic began, people from all over the country have been relocating to Miami, businesses included. But there's one major problem. Real estate prices are soaring to new levels. Mayor Suarez is doing an incredible job in attracting new industries and new companies to Miami, but we have to have the ability to house those professionals that are coming to work here. According to the Miami Association of Realtors, the median sales price for houses jumped another 15 percent just last month. In the new Ocon Tower, studio apartments are starting at $387,000. It's a challenge that both the private and public sector need to, to tackle on and, and provide affordable housing for, for the workforce. At a panel discussion with developers today, Mayor Francis Suarez says it's a supply and demand issue. Right now, there is a tremendous demand and not enough supply. That's why the city of Miami is taking on so many new projects. More than 8,000 condo units and apartments are expected to be complete within the next couple years. It's important that Miami continue to grow because that's what will keep uh, real estate prices down. While real estate prices are at an all-time high, Suarez hopes in time they'll even out. He points out revitalization and growth will help prevent taxes from increasing. We're starting to see thousands and thousands of units that are going to be constructed, which will keep our prices relatively low compared to other major cities in America. Ocon Tower expected to break ground in June. We're live in downtown Miami tonight. Ashley Dyer, CBS 4 News. Ashley, thank you.